What's going on, Solid Steppers? We're going to try this video again. So, I'm going to use one of my brother's lines, Mike Check, my YouTube brother, and appliance repair brother. Back to regular programming. The topic today is going to be everybody needs to eat, but only if they're worthy. Let's keep it 100. So, Miss Ward has a lot of work down here. Q has a lot of work. Brandon, all the, Casey, all of us have a lot of work. So our markets overlap each other. So anytime a dog get a bone, if we can't do it, what do we do? We feed our inner circle first because if the customer calls you, it's an opportunity for you to speak up and throw somebody else the hook up. And that's what we do. Now, that's what happens in my market, in my group that I deal with. But from what I heard, that ain't the same way everywhere. So first of all, when we pass each other change, we don't really expect anybody to throw back a lead or throw back this or that. And the reason being is, at the end of the day, everybody's eating. And then there are things I'm gonna run into that's over my head, there are things somebody else is gonna run onto. So we look out for each other. I don't understand what the problem is, but from what I hear, that's not the case in all markets. So, <clears throat> number one, make sure you on Team 10. Like my boy Grant Cardone shares with us down here in South Florida. You need to 10X your life and 10X your team. So I can put on all hands who I got. In Florida, I got Brandon, Bangin', Q, Bangin', Casey, Bangin', Geo, Bangin', Malcolm, Bangin', Ike, Bangin', Norris, Bangin', Alder, Bangin', Irvin, Bangin', all these guys are banging. Rod, banging. These are people that I can go to and know they got me. Know they handling business accordingly. Everybody don't have that. And I know I left out some names, so get out your feelings. But at the end of the day, there's there's three people that I call. Oh, let's not talk, let's not forget about Mr. Zilka, Richard, my instructor. Banging, banging, banging. So you need to get you a team that you can, number one, make sure you look out for them. Number two, make sure they look out for you. Number three, everybody need to eat, period. I don't understand why that's so hard, you know? We all have belonged to groups and we looking at people side eye because they on that damn okie doke playing games, out here with people money and time. Y'all, I'm trying not to miss my dog on X and I do this every day and I done came 75 so I'm really lost. I don't normally come this way. Florida's got so many damn highways out here through the swamp. Everglades, as we like to call it. It's ridiculous. Man, come on, dude. Here we go. You know I'm trying to get over. You just going to bring your Rico Suave ass over. Oh, boy. So anyway, like I said, we should all be looking out for each other. All we ask you to do, if you go deal with a customer we're recommending or one of our customers, don't embarrass me. Make sure you got your good clothes on and your attitude's right. That's all you need. Everything else is irrelevant, man. It's all about what we do and how we eat. And we eat as a team down here in South Florida. Mic check. Bang it. You know what I'm saying? We got people that are always looking out. And I appreciate every one of these guys. I ain't. I'm telling you, I couldn't do what I do without them. With that said, get you a team.